a couple of days ago after finishing my project, I found out that DaVinci wanted to render out my video to 24 frames per second. I didn't want that. I wanted it to be rendered out at 60 frames per second. I tried going into the settings and I tried changing it, but no luck. Today, I'm going to go ahead and show you how I was able to fix it. Let's get started. So, uh, it was this video here. I'm going to go ahead and open it up for you. When did the deliver pane, by the way? If we look over here, it says frame rate 24 frames. Usually at the beginning, it shows you that the, the video project is going to be changed to a different frames per second. And I forgot about that this time. I didn't. I wasn't paying attention and I just started working on the project, started making my edits and all that. So for whatever reason, I want to show this too, for those people that use Shadow Play to record their videos. Um, this video got recorded at 60.96 frames per second. I don't know why. Shadow Play just messes up sometimes. Like sometimes it'll record your videos at 59 frames per second. It was just weird. If you're trying to render out a video at 60 frames per second, look for another video that's perfectly at 60 frames per second. So I have one right here. You go to properties, go to details, and it's going to show frame rate 60 frames per second perfectly. So um, yeah, just keep it to the side here. Now go back. Make sure this is already saved. If you don't trust me, we can go ahead and make changes, and then you can hit save as. That's if if you want to be really cautious. So, get out of the deliver, go to edit, and then it makes sure that you're showing all of your file, all of your project. Um, usually, I use Alt Scroll Wheel, but you can do it right here too, and then highlight everything. Just hold click and. Um, hold left click I'm sorry and then what you're gonna do is control X I do control X to get everything out of there and then all of this stuff go ahead highlight it hit delete uh, actually do it in the media go ahead and it's already all selected go ahead and hit delete make sure you're in the media plane pane and yeah delete the clips now go ahead and grab that video that's exactly the frames per second that you want drag it there and this is the this is the message that you want change project frame rate yes change it to 60 frames per second for me thank you and now go ahead and go back to edit and just go ahead and control v and all your stuff will be there let me go ahead and scroll down. I'm not lying to you guys. <laughs> Believe me. So back at the deliver pane panel, I don't know what I should call it. Um, it's going to show you frame rate 60 frames per second. And you can just go ahead and title it, chase, change where you want it to save, add to render queue, and render it. And that's how you change it. Hopefully this worked for you. I know that when I make helpful videos, people still have issues and they tell me that my solution didn't work for them. Hopefully that's not the case for you. Thank you. Bye-bye.